Again. Now it's time to find out what else is trending with a roundup of winter must-haves. The person in the know, former Oprah producer and lifestyle expert Karen Fursell, you are back here I'm in Toronto back. with us. I'm like crying tears of joy. <laughs> it feels so good to see everybody, and thank you for having me. It's amazing. It took. It was too long, you know. We're in each other's been... DMs saying, "When can you come yes. back?" And when can you? So it's really nice that October you October twenty second, twenty nineteen was when I was wow. last. I know it feels like forever, but we're get to do what we love, and I, I'm so grateful. So. Thank you, science, and thank you right. for everyone for doing that. Listen, a lot of us during the uh, pandemic became to our own little bartenders. Yes. And so we're going to yes. start by we're talking st about some drinks and yes. mythology. Yes, there's nothing better. Even as early in the morning, it's nothing better. This is Flavor <laughs> Blaster. So we did. We became these at-home bartenders. We wanted to have our moment. And this is what they're calling an aromatic or theatrical serve. Ooh. So this is a device that basically works with an aroma, and you can put that that aroma and this this bubble on any oh. drink <laughs> you can do it that on desserts amazing. you can do it on and they have different scents and different um, aromas so that'll just enhance the drink it'll enhance the dessert it's super fun my kids love when I do it yes and you become this hero bartender and it's beautiful. like poof, it's like magic. Yes, yes, and you can smell it. It's so delicious. Yes. It smells incredible. It makes everything more fun. It can be alcoholic or not, and All that right. looks delicious. Speaking of, yes. Okay, mm -hmm. so sangria is actually the it drink of fall and winter. I know it sounds okay. like a summer drink, but if you do it the right way, it really becomes this beautiful fall drink or winter drink. Yeah. This is, um, I wanted to pull some like local and Canadian based wineries. This is in a yeah. and it's one of Canada's oldest wineries and they have a cab Merlot that I turned into a stone fruit sangria. Delish. So you do white wine, or sorry, red wine, you do a bunch of different fruit and it infuses into the, into the wine and then you can make a big batch. It's great for parties, yeah. but you're using the seasonal flavors and so that's really great. And then uh, Jackson Triggs is another a Canadian brand that everyone loves. They have something for everything. This is their Pinot Grigio and I made a mm. apple pie sangria. <gasps> so various different parts of apple you can pour in. This is wine. This is apple cider. You can pour oh, that yeah, right yeah. in. Let me go for it. Um, and then you can add cinnamon sticks. You can add it you can add it into the glasses. Um, you can add pear. Do you I need add to add apple. any more wine into here? Maybe just yes. for mine. <laughs> well, that was a base. That was a base of um, okay. apple cider, oh, and so this okay, is the wine. It. And then I will give you this, and you can just add in Thank all you. the beautiful colors. So that's really that's great, and you know it's a great way of people sort of getting together for a bigger group, and then you have something that can be yeah. you know made ahead of time, and everything infuses together. Beautiful, beautiful. stone fruit of the season. Yes. I think it's great because we do think sangria summer, but no, think sangria to fall no. winter now. Yes, change your mind. It's Love that. Very fall and wintery. So um, pancakes. Yeah. And and Sunday mornings, weekends, we're, we've been cooking more at home. Um, I don't want to feed my kids the white flour, white right. sugar pancakes. So Organic Traditions does this superfood pancake mix, which is amazing. It's brand new. They have a matcha, an original, and a chocolate. And what's great, it has, I know, it has prebiotic banana flour. You're going to be hearing a mm. lot of that ingredient mm. coming into 2022. And it's really high in fiber. It also mm. has coconut flour and oat flour. And it tastes and feels like real pancakes. And and it's so delicious and it's really nutrient dense so really good for you, you and your kids. See I love a more dense pancake and I love the fact that you can make that into a protein pancake yes. if you want through your protein powder. Throw in. it in, throw some egg whites, it's some very hearty, whites. it's very filling so yes. it's really good. Yeah. Really exactly. good. Okay, so since we're talking about feeding the kids some breakfast, let's talk about the kids at home. I know. So Barumba Play was yeah. founded. I love this story. It's founded by a, a Canadian mom who's a CPA, and she was at home during the pandemic and watching her kids play, but not be engaged enough in the activity. So yeah. they were sort of bored. So she created these as bigger than life um, type of foam blocks that can be made <laughs> into so many different configurations, <laughs> couches, yeah. forts, tents, anything. And I just love it because they're super soft. The kids Kids can be very creative and build, yeah. and um, and then you're not missing all your cushions off your couch, right? I mean, yeah. so she really thought this, you know, I need to problem solve this issue that I have, and she created this. It was great. See, just a regular mom at home, a CPA, yes. and she also comes up with this. That's phenomenal right? because now you're not going to get in trouble for taking all the cushions off the couch. That's the point of it. And 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 high five to women entrepreneurs, right? Yeah. I mean, we we need to support them, and I thought that was such a great idea. Very cute and very chic, actually. I love the blue that it's in. Yeah, yeah. You have 
have another fun activity I for do, the kids. I do. So gaming's a big category. Obviously, I'm always yeah. trying to get my kids off the games. But totally. this is Backyard League. They've combined a gaming platform with actually physical activities. So okay. you're going to take their proprietary baseball. Yeah. You're going to link it to their app. So when you're throwing or catching or doing all these drills, the metrics are going to be measured on the app, and you're going to get commentary oh. from, like, the app. You're going to yeah. get a crowd roar. <laughs> you're going to get all these great things. And then what you're going to do is your metrics will compete against their global leaderboard. So oh. it's 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 still gaming, of yes. course, but it's very active, and yes. it's sort of it, it, the kids feel like they're inside of a real video game. And it's a good combination. Once you throw me that ball, it's oh, a yeah. good combination of tech and getting them active. Exactly. So take your phone outside and throw the ball around. Have right. some fun with super, that. Super super fun. Now we're moving into fashion. We're moving into fashion because I found another Canadian brand. This is called Sophie Grace. Okay. I'm going to give you a pair of these pants, and I'm speaking girl code right now yeah, because yeah. we are always trying our hardest to find the perfect black pant. Always. This is it. This yeah. is this is their Hamilton pant. So you can tell the fabric is beautiful. It's stretchy. It's stretchy, yes. and there's no there's just a pull on waistband, which I, we everyone loves, of course. Favorite words, pull on. Exactly. So this woman created this line prior to the pandemic. She wanted it to go from work to play. Yes. And and now it really just took off. And I love it because she really only has two three colorways. Oh, I so love that. So it's white or ivory, navy and black. Yes. And so again, all the peaches are going to mi miss and match and 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 yeah. sort of be together and you can pull together all these different things and I just thought, you know, especially when she really thought about what women would want from a black pant or yes. a blazer or a dress, that's it. We need the simplicity, and we need stuff that just works no matter what, no matter if it's Zoom or we're heading to the coffee shop. So 100%. that is fantastic. 100%. Thank you for that roundup. <laughs>